"'Twas the night before Vlogmas, when all through the house, not a puppy was stirring, not even a mouse. Cameras were charged by the outlets with care, burnout looming above us. Help me, I'm scared. The puppies were resting, cookies baking in the oven. The calendar was stuffed with plans by the dozen. As the night winds down, we snuggle up in bed. As the worries of Vlogmas begin to haunt Remy's head. All right, Rem. It's your 10th year of Vlogmas. You ready? I don't know. I just keep feeling like something's gonna go wrong. You'll be fine. Okay. Good night. Good night. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 20. I cannot wait. I cannot believe we waited. Oh my god. I cannot talk this morning. I cannot believe we made it to day 20, you guys. As you can tell, I'm still waking up. It's already like past 11. I slept in last night like a baby. I think I was so tired and like the warm bed. Well, in case you didn't know, being in the mountains, we are in beautiful mammoth this morning. It's stunning. Oh my god, there's like a pool over there on that deck. It's kind of reminding me of the Lindsay Lohan Christmas movie. If you guys watched that on Netflix, I love mammoth so much. Do I have a booger in my nose? Oh my god, help. Oh my god, ew, I did. I did, I'm sorry. What a messy start to the vlog. You couldn't see it, we're good. Today, Alicia and I are gonna go skiing. Well, she boards, I ski. It's gonna be so much fun. It is so cold. I'm st currently standing barefoot on the floor right now, so my feet are freezing. And we're just having a nice slow morning. I just ordered some food. We're gonna eat before we head out. And I'll see you guys along the way. We got the cozy fire on. Good morning, Alicia Marie. Ollie's sleeping, so we should probably be quiet. Oh, <laughs> she's <laughs> She's eating a salmon salad, and we've got some coffee here. First sip of coffee. Quite mediocre. <laughs> Quite mediocre. Quite mediocre. You know what though? I did put a liquid IV in this last night, and then put it in the fridge, which I definitely need this. We gotta stay hydrated, especially in the mountains. Okay, guys. Alicia just said she's like, I think I'm gonna bring my payday bar on the slopes, and I was like, no, honestly, it's good to bring a candy bar or something to give you some energy when you're up there because you're burning a lot of calories. And then I had this memory with my dad when I was a kid. I think I told you guys yesterday, but my parents are huge skiers. They're very, very talented skiers. So growing up, they were really into Shane and I skiing, and we'd always come up to Mammoth, and we go like multiple times a year. It was so much. Fun. And one of my fondest childhood memories was being on the Mammoth ski lift with my dad. And he would always bring a score bar, which is like, it's a well known candy bar, but like not super well known. They like sell them at Target and Ralph's and things, but I feel like people, it's very underrated. It's like a, a toffee bar that's covered in dark chocolate. It's so, so good. It's like a black, long, skinny bar. And I'd always look forward to him bringing one on the slopes and we would share it. And it's like one of my favorite childhood memories. So I thought I would call my dad if he picks up and tell him that I'm thinking about it because I just would love to have the on on video on record let's call him and see <gasps> hey Remy is this snowing up at Mammoth no it's not it's just beautiful though oh it's but I mean do you have fresh snow no is there fresh snow yeah. oh Alicia said yes I didn't know <laughs> yeah. you know why I'm calling okay. you though why are you okay no I'm okay I was just telling oh. Alicia she was like I think I'm gonna bring she likes payday bars so she's like I'm gonna bring my payday up on the slopes and it made me think of the score bar that you used to bring up and we would share <laughs> I remember that. I would always look forward to it, and every time I see one now, I think of you. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. I'm with your mom right now. We're actually at our cabin. Oh, right here. doing some holiday shopping. You got dragged out uh, there. Uh, <laughs> you got dragged yeah, out I, there. Yeah, I, I need to pick up some things, too, so I don't mind. Oh, well, so what do you guys have plans for today? We are just going to go hit the slopes in a little bit, and then we're just going to get some dinner and hang out. Just relax. You're over there at the Westin, over there by Canyon Lodge area? Yeah, by, the, by Canyon Lodge. Yeah, that's a nice place. Hey, you, that's the place you got lost uh, maybe about half a mile away. From where you're at. Alicia, <laughs> this is where I got lost when I was about on this side. Wait. My dad just said on Canyon Lodge. Wait. <laughs> oh my god, I'm ready. <laughs> and I'm gonna wear my white pants today in honor of her. Okay, I love you, Dad. Have fun. They're at Cabazon. Have a good time. Be safe. Okay, love you. Bye. I started getting emotional. I think I'm about to start my period again. No, I'm starting any minute. My pants are so <laughs> Anytime I talk to my pants, I just cry. <laughs>
Why am I crying? Okay, we're getting ready for the day. We need to wear fleece line leggings underneath our ski pants because it's cold out. So I brought these ones from Aloe that I bought like probably like four or five years ago, honestly. They're great, but the only thing is they kind of pill up in like the crotch area and they kind of pill at the bottom. So I'm sure everyone knows this, but this is like a fabric shaver. This is a game changer. You just turn it on. Granted, it like shaves the fabric, so you don't want to do it too many times because it's going to like actually take away from it. But for little things like this, it's great. I'll usually just do it like once a year. Clean it up a bit. Thick thighed ladies, you know how sometimes the crotch can get. Like, what's it like for your thighs not to touch? I will never know. I will never know in my life. I got two. Oh, here's a really good one. Oh, yeah. This, see this one? She needs it. I'll link mine down below if you guys want. Much better. It's not like 100% back to, to normal, but I mean, better than before. Look at all that. It's picking up crazy. Good as new, almost. Also, my food has arrived. I ordered my room service. We have <gasps> grilled shishito peppers. You guys know how I feel about shishito peppers. Let's see if they're as good as mine. Mmm, no, but good. Grilled chicken, beautiful. I'll just be eating these with my fingers. Honestly, like one of my favorite meals. The chicken looks great. I'm feasting. It's honestly really good. All right, guys, we're almost ready for the mountain. I am wearing all white again because I didn't learn my lesson in the fifth grade. In case you didn't know, I'm sure we all know. I got lost. Well, I'm sure you heard from my dad's phone call. I got lost on Mammoth Mountain when I was in the fifth grade. Uh, I ended up falling into a tree hole and I was there for quite a while. I ended up being gone for like a couple hours. My mom and dad thought that something happened to me. It was like this big drama thing. I was crying, sobbing. Obviously, Obviously, I ended up being found. It's a long story, but I am wearing all white, but I'm wearing this blue jacket that I think will keep me safer. Don't you worry. This top is from Amazon, actually. It came in a pack of three. It came with a white, a nude, and a black, and it's really nice and comfy. It's stretchy. It's thick. I feel like maybe I should wear another layer under this, but I do run pretty hot, so I think it'll be okay. I've got the jacket on that I got from, I think, honestly, this is from Amazon as well. I'll link them down below if you guys are interested, if I can find the links. Actually, I think this whole outfit is Amazon. My ski pants are from Amazon as well. They just have really good quality stuff for a good price. Ski stuff can get really, really expensive. So I'll link it all down below. And then in my pockets, I'm gonna put in, of course, liquid IV, very important. I think I only have one pocket. So you know what? I'll put it on the left pocket. Oh wait, no, I have one here. Okay, we'll do this. Left pocket will be liquid IV. Right pocket will be camera. I'm bringing this little cannon guy that flips up and you can also put it like on a stand like this. It's amazing. And this will be really good for getting content of both Alicia and I on the mountain. I'll bring that lip balm, of course. I have my road toast lip peptide treatment thingy. I'm gonna put that in there because they get dry. And then I also need my ID. ID and credit card go in there. I took my engagement ring off because I'm not gonna lose that, obviously. And then most importantly, sunscreen. Did you put sunscreen on, Alicia Marie? Oh, what? Yeah, duh. This is the Beauty of Joseon one that I've been using. It's a Korean brand. I'll also link this down below if you're interested. Focus, focus, focus. Very important. The snow is very refreshing. Wait, I saw this on TikTok. It's so good. I learned you're supposed to do your whole fingers worth. And your ears. Oh yeah, ears too. The back of your neck. I maybe should have not done this on with a ski jacket, but the rubbing. Mm -hmm. All right, that's the look. Ready to hit the slopes, yay. I do need my Celsius, I need to wake up. Oh my God, yes. Hello, Remy's vlog. It is me, Ollie. Remy wanted me to film a clip while I was in the hotel room and they're skiing. So while they're skiing, this is what I'm doing. I'm sitting by the fire. I just ordered some room service and it, it wasn't that good. I think I'm gonna go to town soon and see if there's something better. Got my icon pass, yay! Alicia's getting the skis and snowboard and we're gonna hit the slopes. Wide calf ski boots are clipped in. <laughs> We're in the gondola. Hello. Yeah. She's so excited. I, I, this is my happy place. She, she loves my it. My favorite person. Ah! Over Coachella? I mean, this is the new adult happy place. This is the new adult happy place. We love it. We normally obviously come in a big group, but everyone's kind of, they go at their own speed. Sometimes we lose people. Mm -hmm. I said this yesterday, but Murph is the king of bye and just like leaves and we can't find him. And so we're stressed all day. Obviously, if you know Murph, he's never been stressed a day in his life. So no. he's like, it's <laughs> fine, it's fine. But with us, we but go at the same speed. When he's the leader, it's a problem. That's the, that is a problem, <laughs> That's yeah. That's the problem. That's when we all get like all dispersed, but it's so nice because we can go at our own speed. Mm -hmm. We're in the gondola. And and we're going up to the top, and then we take a ski lift up from the top, right? Yeah, we I have go, the worst memory. We go to the top, and then we take oh. chair twelve. Chair twelve. I forget the name of it, but you take that, and it goes halfway where McCoy is. Okay, we're gonna see when we get there together. We'll all remember together. Yeah, we'll figure it out. First clip in of the season. Ooh, 
Oh yeah. Oh fun. Full surf, full ski. I like it. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> we are on our first. I don't even know if you can hear me. On our first little run. Alicia's just getting back in the hang of it. I am here. Skiing! It's cold. I wish I had a little face guard. I didn't realize it was gonna be this cold. Alicia Marie, say hi! We've decided to take a little bit of a break after one run because my feet are already kidding. One and a half. One and a half, you're right. Because wide feet, wide calves. If anybody has wide feet and wide calves, please let me know how you ski without your feet hurting. Because mine were in so much pain. Also, I have like arch problems already and tendinitis. So like, <laughs> it's, a, it's a lot of things. So, you know. We got a little drinky drink. Cheers. Actually, I would love some. If you've never tried to cut water, they are strong. <laughs> <laughs> it's strong but good. I know I give her a hard time about paydays. I haven't had a payday in actually like probably two decades. Oh Ew, my god, I'm so old. Okay, here we go. <laughs> the tiniest nibble. The caramel. <laughs> mm. She's indifferent. It's not bad. I won't be buying one. But you might have another bite? It's not bad. No, I think I'm good. No. Oh. I'm so full. Ooh. <laughs> I'm gonna attempt my videographer skills and get a good video of Alicia. Here I go. We are on the lift. Woo! We got our own lift too. It's probably really loud because of the wind, but look at how beautiful. This is insane. It's also so quiet up here on the mountain. Look at how beautiful this is. I don't know how much you guys can see me, but it's so pretty. Wow. Oh my God. Hello everybody. Okay, we got down the mountain. We I took my braids out because my extensions were showing in the back, so hopefully my hair doesn't look too haggardy. But we are now getting some food. We definitely worked up an appetite and we are going to the place that Alicia has been begging to go since we planned this trip. Where are we, Alicia Marie? <laughs> She said the competitors of her first job. Fun fact, Alicia used to work at a pita shop called Extreme Pita in Riverside, which I did go to when I was in college, but she had already moved away, sadly, so she didn't get to make my pita, but pita pit, it's delicious. It's like a subway, but pitas instead of bread. We got a little condiment station. Oh, can I do onions, please? And that'll be it. I would love, oh, I did the onions already. Can I do um, raw onions, though, as well? Um, oh, I'll do romaine, please. Yes, thank you. Oh, that looks great. And then, um, yes, onion and tomato and cucumber. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> Come to Pita Pit. <laughs> we got our pitas. I don't know if it's as good as Alicia Marie would have made I it. I just wish I could make it for you, but like, you can't make this shit at home. You can't? Why not? No, because the bread's like, you have to be, it has to be frozen and then let out every morning. Oh. That's how like, it doesn't fall apart. You can't do that yourself? Also, they got new paper. Mukbang. I'm literally that person who like, acts like they know everything. She did work at Extreme Pita. Here's mine. I did turkey, avocado, honey mustard, mayo, lettuce, tomato, cucumber. I think that's it. It's like the size of a little baby. Mmm. Last time I got the buffalo, so this time I decided to get the Philly cheesesteak. Mmm. Mm, so good. Cheese is zoning out. Mmm. It's very good. Oh, I did grilled onion too. We were walking on our way to get coffee, and then we passed this little toy store that has jelly cats. And you know what? Someone on Pretty Basic was like, Remy, you don't need to be embarrassed for liking toys. You need to rock it more. Sounds like that. I didn't see that, but thank you so much, and I do love toys. I'm like, look how cute. These are the jelly cat holiday collection. Oh, a little ornament. I'm loving jelly cats. I got a jelly cat that looks just like Momo, actually. Mom, this, this is, is so, so cute. cute. <laughs> this is me. This is me. That's you. <gasps> that one. In, no. the, in the puffy jacket. Yeah. <laughs> I'm done. That's her final answer. <laughs> is she sledding? <laughs> She's cute. Oh, the tail freaks me out a little bit. The little jelly cat candy cane. That's jelly cat. It's so cute. It's a little poinsettia. Little little like keychains. Frog. Frog. Ollie's watching. Frog. Mine and Cal and Ollie's group chat is called Mr. and Mrs. Frog. I actually came in because I saw socks, and you guys know I was trying to find funky socks for stocking stuffers. Cute. Little moose. Oh wait, this is actually perfect. <laughs> I'm assuming you mean for Lauren? <laughs> <laughs> for Cal's brother. And for Lauren. Hi, Lauren. Thinking of you. This is, yeah, with no, no context. I found out someone else is coming to the cruise Christmas. I don't know who. Which means that I need to get more stockings. No, for me. And look at this. <laughs> she did say she'd wear them. Here I go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now for the greatest treat of all time, Rocky Mountain Chocolate Factory. Oh my God, this is my favorite. 
forever. After a long day on the slopes, my parents, if we were good, were able to come in here and get one piece of candy. Peppermint bark, chocolate dip pretzels, graham crackers, truffles. Okay, I'm definitely getting a truffle. Milk and cookies truffle, black cherry truffle. Hello all, my hair looks bad. Thank you, babe. We're just having a little night in, in the <laughs> hotel. We've been sitting by the fire, watching movies and talking, and now we it's time. We any of that. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time for the small business haul and I thought that I would have our wonderful friends join us for this one because I'm very excited. Who wants to unwrap her? All of us. Okay. One, two, three. Wait, I can't do it. Yay! If you guys watch the small business hauls every year, you know that one of my favorite days is to order from a small business that does fun food, candy, snacks from around the world. And that is today. So we're gonna do a little taste test. This is from Golozinas. I will leave them linked down below. So cute. I honestly don't remember what I ordered, but this is Me. gonna be so fun. Hell yeah. Okay. <gasps> oh my God, we got so <laughs> bubbles, much stuff. Please look at this. I so much hit. stuff. <laughs> one at a time, ladies. Thank you. We have a little card here. Wait, I was their third website order. <gasps> oh my God. They said we are constantly adding new delicious products. So please consider joining our mailing list for the best deals and product updates. I will absolutely be doing that. Oh, and they threw in some free stuff. Thank you guys Yay. so much. So okay, we'll leave them linked down below, obviously. Uh, let's do, you know what? Let's do a haul and then we'll go through everything individually. Oh my God, the bags got crazy because of the altitude. Okay. Oh my God, I'm scared. First up we have, this looks like it's from Thailand, I'm assuming. Like it is a stir fry shrimp with chili and garlic flavored potato chip. That sounds amazing. That's so fun. Oh yeah. Next up, <gasps> some sort of boba, boba candy. Milk tea flavored tapioca candy. Tapioca candy. We got ice cream Kit Kats, which I, I have Kit tried Kats. these already and I'll hold my judgment. I'll hold my review. Oh my God. They're so like stuffy full <laughs> because of driving up here. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> these are, what is this? I don't even know what this is. Mystery flavor. Wait. Oh, sweet potato chips. Black sugar flavored oh. sweet potato oh. chips. I don't even know what that would taste like. Me either. We have here, these are craft beer flavored ruffles. Cal's That's crazy. I'm sorry. I, know, I wish Cal were no. here. No. No? Not for me. We have sesame sauce hot pot <gasps> flavored lays. Oh my God, Absolutely no. for me. That sounds amazing. <laughs> we have charcoal grilled chicken and som tum flavor. Oh, it's two flavors. How Ooh, do they have oh, every one. flavor of lays? It's amazing. Okay. <gasps> we have like a taiyaki looking guy with some chocolate on the inside. I'm so full. Hello Kitty barbecue oh, chips. I love it. Okay. Oh my God. We have so many fun Kit Kat flavors. Are those new Noodles. All of these are Kit Kat flavors. These are noodles. Oh, so cool. I'll bring them home and eat them. Don't you worry. Oh, I got a Bulldog. carbonara bulldog noodle. One of my favorites. I just got these to have in house. Like yeah. Oh, have you not tried it? No. Are you hungry enough to try it? Tomorrow. Okay, tomorrow we'll try it, guys. Come back to Vlogmas Day 21 for that. <laughs> and then, oh my God, I've been wanting to try the banana milk. It's banana good. milk, viral. I think it's Korean actually. Yeah, it's Korean. And then we have here bulldog tteokbokki. Ah, uh, my God. Okay, we'll try those tomorrow. And then we've got other little candy bags in here. Just like a bunch of fun little guys. So, all right, let's go through these everybody. Okay, let's start with all the chips. Okay. Be careful opening. Oh. Ooh, <laughs> Alicia, excuse you. Okay, oh wow. The smell is pungent. One, two, three. It smells three. spicy up close. Cheers. Mm. Wait, I mm. love that. Oh my God. I like it. Holy shit. It tastes like a meal in your mouth. How do they get that flavor? It tastes exactly like what it says. Oh my God. Like, I feel like I had a full like bite. Like a grilled shrimp. And honestly, it tastes like I sucked on a shrimp head. Like it's yeah. that flavorful. That took me on a journey. That I was crazy. I hope they all do, honestly. Okay. <laughs> That was the first one. Let's now try sesame sauce hot pot. Whoa. The, I don't like that smell as much. Okay. Mm, like I don't it, it just smells a little more artificial. Okay. Mm. What I, the fuck? It I, tastes like the soup. It literally tastes like Heidi Lau. Yeah. That is so weird. How do they do that? I don't know. This is so weird. Lays, you better explain this yourself. This is scary. What is in there? Oh my God, the smell. <gasps> it just hit me. Oh my God. Oh, wait, it smells like mm. maple, like, um, wait. like a banana. Maple syrup. Also, side note, these are like real. I, I didn't know Lays. Chips. Yeah, they did like put sweet potato chips. Like that's a real sweet potato chip, not a potato chip. It looks like a plantain. Oh my God. Actually it does. Mm. Well, I don't know. Mm. That's like a five cardboard. 
I've never been a sweet potato chip fan. Like, you know those like Terra chips? See, I yeah. am. Mm. I love them. I think flavor though, is it smells better than it tastes. Flavor wise. It's There's very not subtle. Much, there's not much going on. You're mm -hmm. so right. Ooh, so. I like that smell. Oh, it does smell chicken -y. Wait, This is so, so weird. Is it too, like, is each, so two which, is this chip that one? Mmm, that or looks is, like it. Or maybe it's two flavors in one. I'm not sure, but it smells like chicken. That's so crazy. Wait, no, crazy. this one smells like this for me, right? I can't tell. Oh yeah, yours smells sweeter. Mm -hmm, mine smells mine. more like chicken. Mine smells very what chicken. Mine smell like? Yours smells like hers. Okay. Whoa. Mm. Mm. I liked it at first and then I hated it. I like it. Mm, this is my favorite so far. Wait, it, it reminds me of a meal I had when I was a child, but oh, I hate actually, it. Actually, I really like these. They're kind of mm. like citrusy. Yeah, what's that flavor? Like a lime. Mm. Oh, there's lime. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Beer chips for I'm last. I kind of like this. Watch, it's our favorite. Ooh. Right. Mm. Ew. <gasps> Whoa, and I got like the I got the strongest punch of beer. But think about it, if, like sniff, 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 sniff. if we liked beer, we'd love it. I'm gonna bring these home for Cal for sure. I'll yeah, have to like, have, like encapsulate them, them. It smells rancid. Okay, yeah. Listen, smell. I used to like pass blue ribbon. Flavorful. Okay, pick me. Ew. I don't hate it. I don't hate, but it- Wait, it's kind of good. It tastes just like beer. It's it's like, it's so good at flavor profile. <laughs> Wait, but this I don't is like still that nice, taste. it's not wrong. Wait. Oh, they're, they're, it's the wavy. They're the big it double like crunch. Blue ribbon. Water. A little palate cleanser with some banana <laughs> milk. I know all of the uh, K-pop girls like this, don't they? We'll all sip from it, you can go first. What if we just squirted it in our mouth? Okay, you oh. can do that too. <laughs> I'm gonna save my thoughts till everyone has. I love it. It reminds me oh, of so the leftover milk that you had from Honey Nut Cheerios that you put bananas on. Yep. Mm. And then you have a banana with the milk. Like it does taste good, but I would never drink a whole thing like that. I would, I would drink buy it. this a hundred yeah. times over. I would buy a lot of it. I love this. I don't like like the Nesquik like strawberry milk very much. And I know they have a banana one I think, but this is amazing. Mm. But I also don't like banana flavored things. Oh, it's so good. I love banana anything. This is really, really good. I give this a 10 out of 10. Oh wow. Red bean mochi flavored Kit Kat. This is so cool. What's this? Uh, were there more Kit Kat? Red bean mochi, vanilla yeah. ice cream, Kit Kat. I love it. It tastes exactly like ice cream. Wow. How do they do this? I don't understand how they put that, these flavors into things. But that makes more sense because it's chocolate. Like, mm. <gasps> what? <laughs> caramel pudding. We have yeah. banana caramel. I'll try peach. Guys, there's also salt lemon. You gotta try salt lemon. You try cookies and cream okay. and banana. I'm gonna try red bean mochi and caramel pudding. Here we go. I love how you can just tell this is Japan. This is so exciting. Hmm. Like it, it's exactly what I would expect. Mm. Like it's it's good, but I just prefer a regular chocolate. Does anybody like red bean here? No, I don't no. either. Okay, yeah, <laughs> I didn't like that one. I'm sorry. I'll I didn't the love the pudding. banana caramel cookies and cream. Eight out of ten. Okay. Oh, Not that's bad. really good. Oh, actually, nine. <gasps> it took a minute to settle. Caramel pudding. This one doesn't have much flavor. I don't taste caramel or pudding. I would give these eight out of 10. Oh! Oh my God, this is amazing. It's like a little wafer cream. Oh my God, it's so good. Wait, it's so crazy when you bite into it, the chocolate like melts mm -hmm. on your tongue. Try bite, it's really good. This might be my favorite thing mm. we tried today. Really? I mm. like that it's airy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for being in my <laughs> taste so test. Anytime, Thank you. anytime. I can't wait. I'll get Cal's reaction to the beer chips tomorrow. <sighs> All right, see you soon. Bye. Hello. Alicia just vlogged in the bathroom on the little ledge thing that she got Ollie and I for Christmas, but she's significantly taller than me, so we're gonna rip this off the wall. Hello. Much better. Okay guys, we are getting ready for bed. I thought I would do a little get ready with me. I have this little clip that says bride on it. So cute. Contact are coming out. First things first, brush the teeth. This is my favorite toothpaste ever. Colgate two in one. Come in this little container. Teether brush, now we tongue scrape. If you guys aren't doing this, it's really good for you. And also just helps you keep nice fresh breath. Get all that bacteria off. Okay, next, I put some of my face wash in this little travel container. Little face wash. Hot dry the face. All right, for moisturizer, I'm gonna use the Summer Fridays Rich Cushion Cream. I love this so much. It's so good. Even if you have oily skin, I usually stray away from creams because I have oily skin, but it's so good, you guys. If you have any little active breakouts, I highly recommend, I can't see anything right now, the Inky List Succinic Acid Acne Treatment. It's so good. I don't think I have any like active ones right now, so I won't, but I love that. We're gonna do our Olaplex Lash Serum. 
I do this every morning and every night on my lashes and I've seen such a difference in them. Then I have my Laneige Lip Glowy Balm in Gummy Bear. Just some sort of lip balm on top. And then, cause it's so dry up here, I'm gonna add a little bit more of a moisture barrier on top. I have here the Summer Fridays Jet Lag Mask. This thing is great if you're flying, if you're in cold weather, it's already coming out of the container. Cold weather, like I am. Now I'm gonna go to bed, and we only have a few more days before Vlogmas is over and before Christmas is here, you guys. I cannot wait, I have so many fun things planned over the next few days, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Love you, bye.